Welcome to uh, one of our videos. My name is Henry Jackal. Today we're going to be showing you off the uh, GX24064 TCI MCE edition uh, controlling uh, media portal on a Windows 7 system. This is my uh, personal home uh, home theater PC that I use uh, every day. And I just want to show you off some of the features and if, uh, what the uh, display will show you when connected up to a uh, media portal. So anyways, we're just waiting for uh, Windows to finish booting here. And then we can start. What we're running here is, is uh, the standard Core 2 Duo, nothing, nothing overly powerful, hooked up to a 42 inch plasma via DVI and uh, to, the, to a home network where my uh, home server sits. So Windows is loaded and now we're just waiting for Media Portal to finish loading and we're good to go. For those overly curious, this is being recorded on a Nikon D90 with a 35mm f1.8 lens. Anyways, here we go. We have uh, Media Portal started, so let's go through some of the menus. There you go, so you can see all the little menus that are uh, in the main screen. So, let's just jump directly into videos. So my subcategories are here, action, animated, cult, and independent, etc, etc. So we'll just jump to cult and independent, you know, I can scroll through, whatever. And let's do V for Vendetta. It's a pretty good movie. Plus it was the first one there, really. So the top of the screen shows um, your volume control. The bottom of the screen will show you the progress bar and of course the movie details and your times. So let's jump in like 45 minutes, ah, 30 minutes, let's jump in 30 minutes, see, so you can see the scroll bar has jumped ahead. The display is looking a little purple, it's just a video, in real life it's it's definitely not like that. It's more of a dark color you will see in the uh, top right corner. It's kind of consistent throughout. The video is picking up some weird lighting. Anyways, let's jump into and play some music. Let's try some Almost Alice. It's a pretty good soundtrack. So once again on the top of the part, top of the uh, screen we have the volume control. The bottom of the screen we have uh, the progress bar and the uh, music details. We have it set up that every uh, 20 seconds the song information will scroll by. Right now I'm just scrolling through different songs. There we go. Some some chord. The chord of a blunt band. Come on. Well I like a full body logger as much as the next hard working man. The taste of suds while dealing stud, I can surely understand. Trucker speed, yes indeed, it's nearly getting light. Let's time to switch to whiskey. Go back to the main menu. There you go. So we're back in the main menu. So, and it also works in the pictures category. So here's some of my picture directories. You know, some of this is how I organize my pictures, just by uh, date and year. 
So I'll show you just the picture name that you're looking at. So there you go. We can also go into trailers. It also works in the trailers. We can go most popular. Solitary man, whatever that is. Let's go with the uh, quality large. Anyways, so this is what it gives you. These are all the little features and niceties of having one of our displays connected up to Media Portal. Yeah, the software needs a little bit of spit and polish here and there, but that will come in time with more people using the display. I hope you've enjoyed the uh, little video. If you do have any questions, you can always start, stop by our forums at lcdforums.com. Ask away or email us, talk to us. Feedback's always appreciated. Have a great night. And uh, I'll show you my setup here in a second of my system.